Norway. A podcast by Studio 1430 and Norwegian Dark Arts. Enjoy the cult!
welcome back to the Discover Norway podcast. Today we will check out some uh, a few bands because I really have uh, had an, uh, a big struggle finding good music in the underground from this month. Uh, the song we just heard is named Acts of Penance by the band Vintabris. Uh, Winterbris uh, was founded in 2008 and have since then released the EP The Unrested, their uh, debut album Winterbris, their uh, second album Solace, and now recently they released the EP, or uh, maybe you can call it the single Ad Absurdum. I really, really recommend you to check out Winterbris. Uh, on streaming services, they got some cool videos uh, on YouTube as well. Let's move on to our new band. Let's listen to Liquid Mojo. Liquid Mojo with their new song Liquid Mojo. I really think that uh, if you like uh, Motorhead, then maybe this band is for you. I see, uh, you know, this simple kind of riffing they do. If this riff was played by Motorhead, uh, 
it will have uh, another sound but then you would accept it like a real rock and roll after what i know these guys they are not inspired by uh, motorhead but they like bands such as uh, pantera and uh, rise against and uh, that kind of uh, music well liquid mojo are from stavanger 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 in Norway and uh, they have only been active for like one year so let's give them some more years and they will prob probably uh, make more cool music for us to listen to. Now we will go back to a band that we uh, played uh, I, it was last month or the month before that so uh, these guys they are uh, productive they know how to rock, they make good music. Uh, as you know, I don't do English, so I will not say what the song is named, but let's listen to the band Darkenized. Now it's time to die I never 
Organized. Well, I really think that these guys, when it's Friday night, these guys are meeting up, they are playing their instruments, they are screaming their songs, and they are drinking maybe a bottle of old school, old uh, Jack Daniels, and uh, you know, doing the rock thing, you know, because they are from a small, small uh, island in uh, Norway, and uh, well, I will. I would guess that there is not that much to do, so yeah, you will probably rock with your band. Uh, so Dark Nice, I, I really hope that you would like to take over this podcast one day and uh, talk more about what you do in the weekends or, uh, well, you know, when you are rehearsing and that stuff. Uh, yeah, and as you all you who have listened to this show for a little while, uh, I am very interested in uh, listening to, you know, how the bands are recording their music, how bands are rehearsing, what bands do when they are together, and all that uh, stuff. You know, because, th- yeah, that is cool. And I really think to you bands that are listening, that um, when people get to know you, they would like to listen to your music as well. Uh, I will not bring up the Dark Throne example once again. I have done that like uh, 20 times already. But uh, like Dark Throne. <laughs> yeah, those guys. It's amazing. Let's move over to a band. Oh, yeah. This band sounds like something that I usually don't listen to. But uh, I think a lot of you guys uh, would like to listen to it. Uh, they got a good, pro- good, uh, good production. Uh, and they are really, they really know what they are doing, to put it that way. This band is named uh, Naga uh, Siren, and the song is named uh, Pillar Slash Torrent. <laughs> Naga Siren from Oslo in Norway. This band is like, uh, after what I can see, they are like less than a year old. So, whoa, man. These guys, they know how to play their hardcore music. And even though I'm not into like hardcore music, 
you feel that these guys, they got a thing going. Uh, and I really doubt that this is like a home recording uh, song. But uh, yeah, I would like to figure that out because they got some really, yeah, it's really good production, I think. Uh, the vocalist, um, the, well, I think they are mod vocalists. But yeah, it sounds really good. So uh, a big shout out to Naga Siren from Oslo. Check them out. Now uh, we will move uh, on to a band named uh, OC Demons. Uh, I get, uh, you know, I play music that I think you guys would like to listen to. You know, that usually don't get uh, played on the radio or other places where people find music, you know. Uh, OC Demons. I think they got a good thing going. But I have to be a bit uh, negative <laughs> and say that they sound like a kind of bad uh, Blood Command uh, band. So that is like a, a positive thing because Blood Command is a band that have, um, you know, done big things for the music uh, from Norway. You know, like they got uh, these riffs that are very, very, uh, you know, good uh, they got riffs that you can jump to sing to scream to being angry to you know you can uh, you can go you can stand at a concert with the black metal pose or you can go at a gig and uh, hop around like a fucking hippie you know they got riffs that suits everyone uh, and also they, they got a, a female vocalist that is very awesome and also you know that their new singer is very very nice as well so uh, yeah so blood command very nice but oh to the band oc demons i think that they uh, use a sound <laughs> well use their sound you can hear that they got a very great potential uh but still they sound a bit too close to blood command and they do not peak over them i think so uh i wish oc demons all the best but uh maybe they could try to be a little more creative or something and now let's put it this way if i get a comment below like yeah, dude we do not listen to blood command then i i will drink a bottle of tequila and uh, go and sleep so let's listen to OC Demons with uh, their song. Oh, I got a message. Oh, I just got a cover artwork from uh, my own band. Well, never mind. Uh, OC Demons, here we go. Yeah. 
Oh freedom, oh sea demons, with the song mouth, mouth breather. I actually checked uh, these guys out now, and I see they are from Bergen, <laughs> like the band Blood Command. So I, uh, well, I still think these guys they like Blood Command, and these guys they, maybe they know the band Blood Command. What do I know? They uh, got got the sound, but I yeah I wish these guys the very best, and uh, yeah, they, these guys they they can be something very huge. Now we will listen to a new band, and after that band we will listen to the song. I really think is the best song uh, that was released uh, in uh, June. Uh, and, and then I also I like talking about the big bands so stay prepared for the last song but before that we're gonna hear a song from the band Life Lessons Okay, my bad. That was a Blink-182 song. Okay, I just pushed the wrong button. No, really, that was uh, Life uh, Lessons with their um, with their song. Uh, I'll take it from here. Uh, Stooly, you. 
uh, yeah, so you guys that like uh, punk rock in the genre of like, <laughs> you know, the good old uh, 90s and maybe some 2000, I don't, I don't know, like Blink-182, some for the one lit, um, oh, what are all the, those kind of bands, what are they named? I used to listen to a lot of it, but it's it's been a while. You know what, what's my age again? I, I, I can't recall. Life lesson lessons from Oslo in uh, Norway. Go uh, check them out if you like uh, punk rock with that uh, sweet young man vocal, and you know like a drummer or a bassist or something answering. You you get get a uh, very. It really sounds like uh, Blink One Eighty Two. Uh, a newfound glo a newfound glory, and and that band Goldfinger Goldfinger. They I used to love Goldfinger. Ninety nine, yeah, and Superman. The song Superman by by uh, Goldfinger. Check that out if you like uh, OC Demon. No, if you if you like uh, Life Lessons. Okay, now we're gonna end uh, today's episode with uh, the, the band that started this episode. We are going back to the great band from Bergen in Norway named uh, Vinterlis. Uh, and we will listen to a song named uh, Edges. Uh, I, I have heard this uh, song uh, long before it was done, written and released. So I, I have heard uh, a couple of, uh, you know, how it could be before they ended with this result. And I must say that I am very, very pleased. These guys know what they are doing. And uh, yeah, a couple of things you have to listen to is uh, what the drums are doing, because he is always doing some fascinating stuff. You have to check out what the bassists are doing, because some of the uh, bass guitar lines in this song is truly amazing. It's Mm, so search for the bass lines uh, um, and you will find uh, a lot of joy. And also the last thing is uh, the vocalist. Uh, he uses uh, or he uses a lot of uh, techniques and he goes like dark, he goes light, he, he got this, uh, oh, I think of a band, well I think of the, of, of the band Bethlehem. But uh, I, I don't think he listens to that band. But uh, yeah. And uh, Winterbees. Uh, check out all, all their songs. Because they got. Uh, all their releases got something very real. Very really. Very really nice. But you hear that they are evolving into something big, bigger. And, uh, and maybe, maybe bigger and better for every release they got. Alright, now I say goodbye to you guys. Let's listen to Winterbris with their new song, Edges. I'm a legend.